This week on Chugging the Polar Bears, we're catching up with OAC Swimmer of the Year and National Qualifier Jordan Bredigan. Jordan talks about his success over the past four years and his preparation for the postseason. So Jordan, you guys are shooting for another OAC title in a couple weeks. Can you talk about the season so far? Um, it's been a good season. We've, uh, I guess this is our eighth regular season title. We've accomplished that and uh, coming up, this will be our 10th, hopefully, conference title. Awesome. Jordan, last year you went to Nationals. How has that helped you prepare for this season and hopefully going back to Nationals this year? Uh, well, last season was my second time making it to Nationals, and uh, I made it further than I ever have before. I, I almost made it into the final heat of the 200 fly. I was actually ninth going in, mm -hmm. and my time actually would have put me in third in the final heat. Wow. So taking, from, taking that from last year, I, I'm definitely going to make sure I'm more prepared for the prelim session so that I can make it into the top eight and get all American. You're a senior this year. What kind of legacy do you want to leave for the for your teammates? Um, I really think that all that we've accomplished as a team over these last few years really draws more and more talent toward the team so we can just help build the program in the future. Okay. What do you think that the keys to your success have been in the last decade for the ONU swimming program? I think Coach Ewald has really made a significant impact on our team over the last 10 years. And uh, I don't think we could have done it without her. She instilled a lot of values and really brought us together. And she pushes us to get the most out of ourselves. And I think that's really important in a coach. OK, Jordan, do you have a favorite memory from the past four years? Yeah, uh, two years ago, when we were on training trip in Arizona, we climbed Camelback Mountain as a team. And we packed our lunches and we all hung out there at the top for about an hour or so and just ate and hung out. And it was good team bonding. It was very serene.